Hello everyone, today I will show you how to open your all-in-one HB 24 inch. This is the new model. Uh, previously all the models for all-in-one HB, uh, the opening was by removing the back cover. However, the new models, uh, the back cover is not removable. So you start the opening from the front. So the removing process starts from this sound bar at the bottom of the screen. It is basically a plastic cover fixed with plastic clamps. So you just spray out with your nail or anything. So then you go along okay you can see here now the uh, speakers and the screen ribbon cable and two additional cables for the screen so let's uh, open first this ribbon cable you pull a bit your nail then you can pull out this one the other one also you have to grab tightly don't grab the cable just grab the base then pry out for this one it has no clamp then you have the third one it has clamp at the bottom so you need something sharp to open the clamp then you can pull out so I will use the needle to open Okay. Now you have three screws fixing the screen. This is one screw. Then you have here in the center the other screw. Then you have here the third screw. We open these screws. Okay, now the screen is fixed all around with clips so you have to pry slowly uh, don't uh, force it just pry until you hear the clicks okay so let's put the screen aside this is the screen from the back. Now you can see here the fan and the uh, exhaust is from this side. So the vent of the exhaust is this vent. Then the suction is from here coming throughout the processor and uh, the GPU through the suction vent. So the suction vent in, is in this side. We have the speakers with huge uh, resonance chambers. So uh, this is the speaker, it's quite small, but the resonance chamber uh, chambers are huge. So the bass is quite good. Uh, you have here in the middle, you have the processor and the heat pipe. Then you have the GPU or the graphic card, NVIDIA. Uh, it has two uh, pipes, cooling. Then you can see here we have the RAM uh, is removable. I have two cards here uh, fixed from the shop. Then you can see here this is the Wi-Fi card. Then you have the antenna. You have two antennas, one here and one here. Uh, what else do we have? We have the battery for the system here. Uh, you have to remove this shield if you want to remove the SSD. One bolt here and one bolt here and three small bolts uh, on top once you remove the shield uh, you can see the SSD is fixed by a single screw so you can replace it easily and also you have here uh, the dongle for the keyboard and mouse combo so it's just simple uh, USB uh, A dongle or transmitter for the keyboard so if it stops working you can remove it and connect any other wireless uh, mouse and keyboard 
nothing much here. I couldn't find a SATA port, but we have uh, empty bay. I presume it was for SSD external or uh, for hard disk, hard drive, not sure. But uh, I cannot see any traditional connection for SATA. Then you have here just the USB and the headphone jack on this uh, board. And you have here the power button, uh, the circuit board for the power button. I hope this video was useful. If you find it useful, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And thank you for watching.